Hi, welcome to my channel. It's Vicky again. Today I'm at Salama Springs for something that Vanessa invited me for. If you don't know about Vanessa, I met her at... Huh? There was a meetup at Olives some time back and she has a vibe. You guys know from Instagram as the other account and you know how spiced up she is like her whole life. You want to be her. Yeah. Anyways, <laughs> now she's in the video and yet she said she wouldn't be in the video. So um, this event has um, two chefs. She screenshotted from the side. Sorry, I don't know anything because she just invited me and I said I'd be there. So each of them get to prepare a meal. It's a three course meal. And then as the guests get to vote which um, chef cooked or prepared the food better. So DJ Tennis is providing the vibes and hosting the party along with DJ Vegas. The complimentary drinks are courtesy of Frangolino Limited and Black Hawk UG. So beer buckets are at 30,000 shillings and there's a 20% off all drinks till 8 p.m. for this event. So I don't know how often it's happening. I'm going to talk to the organizers later on. And yeah, for now it's all vibes. I can't wait to experience this. I'm not sure if I'll give you an ending, but if I don't, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more of such content. New and refreshing, right? It's not always restaurants. Okay, bye. My name is Shakib Nsubuga and I work with Salama Springs and uh, we came up with the concept of Chef's Versus. This event is called Chef's Versus. It's an opportunity for people to come and experience like high quality cuisine from two different chefs and actually like judge, give, give an opinion and take like a, a gastronomic journey. I think it's a really different concept from what really goes on uh, around Kampala. We, we select two chefs and uh, these chefs are uh, the form team, so there's team A and team B. Uh, this is the second time we're doing this. Uh, so each chef, uh, they go head to head. Uh, they, each chef makes a three course meal and the guests get to taste each of the meals and vote for each course. So at the end of the night, we have a winner and the winner is given a prize and bragging rights. So that's basically what Chefs Versus is. So you come with a friend or you know, with a group of friends and have a really good evening. So we put on our social media our page, Salama Spin social media page, and we asked um, people to get to nominate chefs. And so many chefs were nominated. They were the most popular. You know, we worked with our senior chefs that, that were uh, that were there in the previous edition, Chef Angelo and Chef Hanat, and they worked with them to get to make sure that we have a standard that we expect. Um, and we really now we're looking forward to seeing what they have to present. Uh, so you get you can get tickets normally on Cricket. So we've been working with Cricket, but you can also call the Salama line and you'll be able to get tickets. So we're still playing around with the concept. Uh, we're open to ideas. We're open to sponsorship. We're open to collaboration. But what we really want to do is to our, our objective is to showcase high quality Ugandan cuisine to show off chefs so that they can actually get opportunities to to work and get gigs and you know promote the craft and just also have a good time.
Nicholas. How was it behind there? Tutis to me. And you had a nice in. starter. Yeah. Yes. Oh. Mm. Perfect. <laughs> yes, a loving call, first time. Yeah, but don't change your taco. Don't change your taco. Don't change Don't change your taco. The taco. <laughs> So I'm a private chef. I'm opening my restaurant in like two weeks. So I'm in you guys know Space Hotel Apartments. For now, you can find me online. I do private dining, private dinners, I also do pop ups. Um, yes. I wanted to switch them up, and I actually did a corporate one. Yes, it is. Is there anything, is there anything that you could change from how you did a front door? And uh, where, where, where do we find you? How do you get your, what, what do you do? Tell us more about your craft. And... Um, so I'm a private chef as well, just like Rina. I do private cooking, house calls, uh, in case you have a party at home, I don't come and do the cooking for you. Um, I do pop-ups as well. I do not in restaurant line right now, but I also develop uh, products. So the matoke that you had today has been a product I want to last week. I hope you noticed it was a matoke. Give it up for Tutti underscore chef. Tutti goes there with a cash price as well as price, price, and she will go there more. She can be a price. I'm going to be. I'm going to be. Yeah, and uh, as well as bragging rights, can we please give it up for our winner of Chef's Passes, episode 2. DJ, give us a jam. DJ Tennis is studying. I hope you enjoyed the episode of this thingy. I've had it happen heartily, but yeah, that's all I know for now. So just for me, I'll tell you what, we, what I voted for. The first one we had, the beef braised taco as the starter this felt like um, of course it was a taco I preferred it to the jackfruit parka and then the second one we had chicken paradise that was amazing that's the one that I think I've had it with different names Kiev something like that I chose that and preferred it to the Guinness braised beef ribs they felt very bland but I feel like that's just a recipe for all slow cooked things and the last we had uh, the pumpkin waffle amazing it has like 20 out of 10 so um, I preferred that to the apple the apple was an apple which seemed cooked so that was it so thank you for watching this episode keep up with me watch my following episodes subscribe like go to the other accounts page follow she's, she's such a vibe you guys all right bye